Well, I'm the fifth generation of automotive technician in my family. So my father, my grandfather, my great-grandfather, it's kind of pushed me to do what I want to do. I've been into cars ever since I was a little kid. School projects, that's all I did was talk about cars and that's basically how it started. For me, it's fixing problems. Um, that's, that's really what I get out of my job, is when vehicles come in with a legitimate problem that might be hard to find, is tracking it down and making a quality repair. My favorite part is not having to do the same thing every day. I'm always greeted with new challenges. I always get to put my mind to work and figure out how to do something faster, do it a better way. GM is very specific on their stuff. They get into great detail, and I've been doing training for the past three, almost four years, and it's still every day and it's a lot to learn and it's actually fun to learn. Well, it might be because I've been working on Chevys for so long, but to me, the procedures and the workflow is, is simpler than other brands. GM wiring schematics are incredible and they really want us to have the most up-to-date information and they really ask for dealer support in that and we get all of that here. Part of my CDC class, which is career development, was to come down and just spend a day in the shop and just see if it's what I really wanted to do. GM started my training and after a week or so, a day turned into, I was here five days a week after school working. And then after that, after I graduated school, I was here five days a week working but it wasn't after school, it was all day. And they just really pushed me forward. It's turned into a paycheck very shortly after I stopped my shadowing. It's really a family here. Um, you know, we've got guys that have been here for a very long time, um, and a lot of them, and that's, that's pretty rare in this industry. If you run into an issue that you're not sure what to do about, you can just, our foreman's always willing to help, our service manager's willing to help, everybody in the shop is just super nice. I actually moved here from Mass about nine years ago. I just wanted to change, get out of the city. My kids were small at the time and I figured it'd be a great place for the kids to grow up. It's like night and day. We have one of the most beautiful places in the country that's available at this cost of living. We're in the wilderness, we have easy access to all the different types of outdoor activities that you can imagine all year round. I spend a lot of my time in the woods, either hunting or fishing. You got Lake St. Catherine, which is over in Wells. There's great fishing over there. It's a nice big lake. Lake Bombazine is just above it. Swimming, kayaking, quads, going on trails. We have a motorcycle that we ride. My wife and I have a little sailboat. We like to sail at Maidstone Lake in Vermont. Come winter, I'm usually on a snowmobile. Snowboarding. I've taken them to a couple mountains so far, and I taught them how to ski and snowboard. Getting away from the city is Really nice change of pace. It slows things down. It's easier to breathe. It's easier to think. It's, it's just exciting. I just look forward to growing. Being a certified world-class technician is my goal. Every day is learning process. All the newer EV stuff that's coming out, there's already courses online and stuff that we're going through and hands-on stuff. Um, one of the techs in the shop's already 100% certified and I'm on my way there now.